Good day, it is Stephen Degert here, and in this video we will continue our discussion on the horizontal scrolling text, and specifically on the formatting of the text, and if you want to create a static curve to complement your horizontal text. From the video sequences default menu, we go then to the default of the blender, and if you do not know what we are doing here, we go too fast, please follow then the previous videos where you will find in more detail and explain what we are doing now. Good, there's your text. Uh, control backspace and let's type in something. God is good. There we, here we are now in terms of our previous videos. If you get out of the edit mode, tip tab, and you want now to curve this tab. Use, for example, a circle, go to add, and then add a curve. We use the circle, nerve circle, because it is very well to explain the concepts that apply to the other curves as well. Nerve curves. Having the curve there, you can now first scale and manipulate the curve as you want to. In this case, let us scale the curve. The curve is selected. Let us scale it and then make it bigger by our mouse movements. Okay, the curve is now as we want it. Go now to the information windows. And on the information windows, we then first select the text. Select the text. And when we select the text, we see on the information window the tab for the fonts that is interactive appears. Hit on the fonts tab, text tab, and then go down. And here you will see a subsection fonts. And on in the subsection fonts, you see then text on curve. And if you left click on this box in the text on curve, you will see the the various curves and in this case there's only one circle so we select that one circle it's a NURBS curve circle we hit it and then you see the text on the curve and it's curved you can now go and format the layout of this circle perhaps if you see there the center how it looks if we horizontally aligned on that curve justified and especially at flush, you see there. But let us now then use uh, the left alignment. This alignment is not to your liking, so go then to rotate and rotate the curve to the position you are happy with. Okay, maybe it is there. God is good. More in the center. Left click to exit uh, the mode and highlight then your text. Perhaps you also want now to further manipulate it by uh, scaling it. And it with the text highlighted, let's click, then hit S scale and then scale it. Okay. And it's the it's not anymore in the center as we like it. So uh, you then rotate and rotate it slightly. You can also then apply the other formatting such as the letters. We want to have the letters close further apart or closer by clicking here on the spacing letter or the words. We want the words closer or we want the words further. Then if it's because the orientation and alignment it out, is out let us then again go to rotate and slightly rotate it so that it is on the center more or less. Left click to finish the function. Your text is as you want to. Thank you very much for watching this video. We love constructive comments. Please like and share this video.